Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. Today, we are going to dive deeper into a very interesting topic that is fat burners. So are the fat burners are the solution to save those extra pounds? Or they are just another fitness myth waiting to be busted? Let's find out in this video. So before we start, let's first understand what are the fat burners. So fat burners are essentially the supplements that contain the natural or artificial compounds. So they can come in pills, powder or even teas. These supplements are supposed to help you to slim down. The hundreds or perhaps thousands of nutrition products right now in the market which are showing us the promise how to lose fat faster and easier. Now if you are somebody who is having a hard time to lose your weight, you might have already considered taking a pill that has been advertised as a fat burner. But the truth is the vast majority of these products burn nothing but your money. Now next we need to understand how do these fat burners work. Now the fat burners don't essentially make your fat burn and create some smoke. Instead they attempt to drive the weight loss in other ways. So they might increase your metabolism so that you can burn more calories. Or they can reduce the amount of fat your gut can absorb. Thirdly, they can suppress your appetite so that you can consume fewer calories. Now let's understand what are the ingredients that you have in most of the fat burner supplements. So there are dozens of ingredients in the fat burner supplement that includes the herbal ingredients and other compounds. You know what are the most common ingredients that you have in the supplements? Number one is caffeine. Now caffeine we all know that it is there in the green tea or coffee and so many items. Now what caffeine does, it essentially stimulates your nervous system and might help you to burn calories. But supplements can contain a lot more caffeine than coffee, tea, chocolate or any other natural source. In fact, too much of caffeine can cause nervousness, jitteriness, insomnia and even a dangerously high heart rate. The second most common compound in most of the weight loss supplements are the green tea extract. So these extracts are generally made from the green tea as the name says. And this ingredient might help you to burn the calories and may reduce the amount of fat that you absorb from your food. But the amount of weight loss is not that significant. In fact, you can burn more calories by taking a brisk walk every single day. The third most common item that you have in many of the fat burner supplements is carnitine. And this compound can help you with your metabolism and also can give you energy. This is found also in many of the meat and dairy products. And in fact, your liver and kidney can make it naturally. But the research on the weight loss benefits is highly questionable. In fact, too much of carnitine can cause many of the health hazards like nausea, vomiting, diarrhea and a fizzy body odor. The fourth most common ingredient in many of the fat burner supplement is Yohimbe. This plant compound comes from the bark of an evergreen tree. It is common in many of the fat burner supplements but can cause many of the negative effects as well. Yohimbe can cause headaches, anxiety, agitation, increased blood pressure, heart problem or even kidney failure. The fifth common ingredients in many of the fat burner supplement is soluble fiber. And this fiber can help you to control your appetite as the fiber is good for your health. And soluble fiber specifically can help you to prevent your body from absorbing fat from the food. Some of the fiber is ingredients that is common in many of the supplements is bleta glucan, glucomannan and guar gum. The next question comes, are these fat burning supplements are really safe? Should I really consume them? Now fat burner supplements are not regulated. So you do not always get a complete picture of what can be inside the supplement. They can make any claim without any factual evidence to support that claim. So you need to be very cautious before taking these supplements. 
Some of the studies also have found that ingredients inside these supplements that are not listed on the bottle. So there is a problem of mislabeling. So it will be very hard to say how this can impact your health. Although some of the supplements have some promising effects, there are concerns about their safety. For instance, consuming too much of caffeine can cause blood pressure. An increased blood pressure can also put people at the risk of heart attack or even death. In some of the cases, the usage of a fat burner has led to other health issues. And as per the report, fat burning supplements can cause acute liver failure. As per another research, fat burner led to the development of severe lactic acidosis. This is when your body can produce more lactic acid than it can metabolize. There is also a risk that the fat burners will be contaminated within the unsafe ingredients. One such ingredient is 2,4-dinitrophenol, I'll call it DNP. And research indicates that DNP has health risk or for humans to the point that it was banned for consumption. But out of 94 supplements that was reviewed and 14 of them contain DNP. So there is always a health risk by taking the fat burners. Now the question comes, it, what are the alternatives to these fat burners in case you know, I know the risk of using them to lose weight. So there are many safer and more sustainable ways to lose your weight. Now we are talking about good nutrition, regular exercise and lifestyle changes that don't just help you to get in shape but also boost your overall health. Now in some cases, you may not always avoid these supplements. If you are still considering using the fat burners or any kind of supplements for that matter, here is how you need to approach them more wisely. Do your research, consult with a healthcare professional and always listen to your body. Supplements can be a helpful tool but again they cannot do any magic for you. Finally, to end with this, whether you are looking to lose your weight or you want to curious about to know about the supplements, we hope that this video has given you enough food for thought. Now if you enjoyed our deep dive, give us a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to our channel for more myth breaking content. Stay informed, stay healthy and remember one thing that the best results come from a combination of knowledge and hard work. Thanks a lot.